pumping station remains active. Engineer D.F. Vaudaramal, D.F. Fuda Steam Pumping Station. The province of Friesland in the Netherlands is mostly wetland. The town of Lemmer faces a large lake that is connected to the North Sea. Many small lakes surrounding Lemmer are connected by a number of canals. About a quarter of the Netherlands lies below sea level. In order to protect the town from damage, a large water pumping station was constructed at the beginning of the 20th century. Water was pumped out by water mills before, but after building this facility, pumping was powered by steam engines. This pumping station was named after its architect. His name is Dirk Frederik Wuda, a Dutch architect and engineer. Construction began in 1916 and was completed in four years. It was the largest steam-powered water pumping station in Europe at the time. When it rains, the pumping station is used to discharge water from the canals to the lake. After the completion of the pumping station, Lemma was finally freed from the threat of flood damage that had previously tormented it for years. This is the steam boiler room. Coal was used as a fuel during the early days, but it was replaced with oil in 1967. The steam boiler is still in active service to this day. The steam created by the boiler is sent to the turbine to move pistons to create energy. Each steam engine turbine has two centrifugal pumps attached on both sides. As the turbines spin, the screw of the pumps also rotates to pump up the water. The DF Vuda pumping station has four engines and eight siphon centrifugal pumps. They can discharge enough water to fill this entire building in just one minute. The pump station can lower the canal water level by four centimeters per day. The method of pumping water has developed from water mill to the steam pumping station. However, the battle against water still continues to this day.